Hi, this is Andrew Moore Crispin with another Android video tutorial series from Butterscotch.com. We're continuing our tutorial series on using maps on your Android phone with a look at getting detailed directions. Maps lets you search for local businesses, your contacts, addresses, and much more. And it also gives you the option to navigate to a destination from within the Maps application. To start, search for an address or business. Tap the search key on your phone or simply tap in the Search Maps text field in the top left of the screen. Here you'll see a history of past searches. You can scroll through and click any entry to find it on the map. Start typing your search query. You'll see Maps filters your contacts and past searches to save you typing. If you see the entry you want, tap on it. Otherwise, continue typing. If you're searching within your immediate area, that is to say searching for an address in the city in which you're currently located, there's no need to enter the city and state. If you're searching further afield though, your results will be more accurate if you include this information. When you're done, hit go or enter on the keyboard. Maps will search for addresses nearby. Tap on the entry you want directions to. In the place page, tap the directions button at the top of the screen. By default, the From field will say My Location. Just tap in the Text field and type an Origin if you need to change this. From either the From or To fields, you can press the Bookmarks icon to choose a point, current location, contacts, a point on the map, or My Places. Current location and contacts are self-explanatory. Point on Map lets you manually select an area on the map by dragging to and then tapping an area. My Places lets you select from points you've marked as favorites with a star. Select the mode of travel, by car, by public transit, by bicycle, or walking. The directions you receive will vary depending on the mode of travel you choose. For example, walking directions tries to send you along quieter streets and disregards the direction of one-way roads. Choose your mode of travel and then hit Get Directions. You'll see an overview of your route. Each instruction is marked as a point on the map. Tap any point to see the associated instruction. Cycle through each instruction in order by using the left and right cursor buttons in the bottom of the screen. In Directions view, you can zoom in and out on the map as per usual. Tap the Page icon in the bottom left to go to a list view of each instruction in turn. Tap and hold any item in the list and choose Street View to get a view from the ground. You can also report a problem by going back to the list view, tapping and holding on an instruction, and then choosing Report a problem with the directions. Looking at driving directions in the list view, you can tap the menu key to bring up some options. Choose Route Options and then check the boxes if you'd like to avoid highways or avoid tolls. At any time in list view, you can change the method of travel by tapping the icon in the top left. Driving, walking, and cycling instructions look similar on the map. Transit instructions, however, are quite different. Rather than seeing a series of turns you have to make, you'll instead see transit schedules, suggested routes, and an approximate travel time, along with any walking directions you may need. Under Select a Trip, tap on any route to choose it. You can use your phone's back button to go back one screen and view the other routes Maps has pulled in. Different transit lines are denoted with a different colored line running along the left of the instructions. Walking portions of the route are shown with a dotted line. If you see a small right-facing arrow icon beneath an instruction, tap to expand. You can see all stops a bus or subway train makes or get more detailed walking directions. In the next episode of this Using Maps tutorial, we'll look at using the turn-by-turn -turn navigation app that's a part of Maps pre-installed on your Android phone. For more helpful mobile tech tips and tutorials, visit Butterscotch.com.